Hey everybody, this is Ku Impact with Let's Play Dark Cloud 2. And we are about to fire the Nova Driver, the ultimate attack offensive weapon of Paznos' systems, at the Griffin Castle. Lord Griffin is going to die. Yeah. As shit should be. Oh, you know the Nova cannons that you that you built on your ride bot. Amplify it like by times 150. It's it's really good. It's just straight up good. It's good, people. It's so good it hurts. Ready to fire, sir. Fire the guns. Fire the guns. Oh, he even got his hand up in the fire position. Oh! Ku likes to do that too when he fires out his giant robot laser. I mean, all mechs have to have a giant laser attack. That's just standard. They also have to have a very convoluted melee attack. But it's not like Pasnos has a convoluted melee attack. You guys seriously missed. I mean, you hit, but you didn't hit it very good. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh no. You guys actually did it. You bamboozled yourself. They did it. You're going to die. Uh-oh. This is very bad. Yeah, it's it's coming down. Like huh? like almost like an oblivion star. Almost. Look. What is the this angle? Is falling towards Palm Brinks. Holy shit, yeah, specifically Tom specifically Palm no Brinks. Yeah, Tom Brinks. Oh uh, yeah, Tom Brinks is gonna die. Sorry, Tom Brinks, if you're out there, uh, Castle's heading towards your head. I don't think you're gonna say it in time. You don't have a high enough perception to perceive this. What should we do, sir? Oh, we're screwed now. One that will erase uh, Alina's point. Oh no! Speaking of Elena, what the hell are you talking about? She shouted it's that pretty loud. You must be joking. Pasnos doesn't have anything like that. Oh, I like how he's like, oh, well, you don't yes, know the robot. You just don't know about it. Oh, what? 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 But Excuse me? Pasnos was in its planning stages. I... History has changed. Since Excuse me? Back in time, things have changed slightly. Wait, the but and how did you would know started. that, though? If he doesn't know it, and the new time stream happened, you wouldn't know it. No, it doesn't. Elena shouldn't know about the Colossus mode, and neither should anyone piloting the ship. Is this because I have a ride pod? I just thought about that. It's like that weird thing where Max might have had the lineage that actually had Monica this whole time. And the whole theory goes down to, is it really incest with these two? Because it could be, they have the same eye shape and nose shape. And front hair bangs. Alright, I'll admit it. Ku likes this giant mechs, so this is pretty freaking awesome. Also, it's got big claw hands. Oh, man. Oh, man. Alright, can you kill Griffin with it? Do I actually have to do the castle at all? I still have to do the castle. <laughs> I like how... Oh my god, Max. Yes! Good job! Your ride pod saves the day again, Max. Can't stop! Doing little things yes, like sir. move the music, doing the music, move the music, bounce the music, rhythm and the music. Can't keep up with it, because my audio is kind of a little bit desynced, I'll admit it. For some reason, it all desyncs when it compiles, so I could edit off a bit, and it still desyncs. Because I've noticed any time I try to sing along with the music in the game, nothing. Oh! Oh, this bitch is empty. Yee! That was the 
slowest yeet I've ever seen. God, the slowest castle crashing into the ground I've ever seen. It's like these guys never played Castle Crashers. Now that is a game. I can't, I can't stop playing it. It might be old as hell, but I can't stop playing it. It just, it just threw the palace. It didn't kill Griffin. It's right there. It could just stomp the palace. Just destroy the Moonflower Palace. No. I don't want to play. <laughs> Come on. We beat the game. We beat the game. Oh, yeah. Osman's talking about Chrono Unions. No, 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 no. Everything's ready. Yeah. I just want to go. I just want to go. I misclicked there. I just wanted to see... I just wanted to see Osmond go, everything's ready. Oh, boy. Here we go. I never said the end game of this game made any sense. Slowly rotate chairs to be in sync. Targeting the enemy. Max's mom. Listen carefully. Griffin's palace is back on the ground. Yes. This is our last chance to take him out. Sure, but I'm gonna run around and not be in there. You're perverted, mom. No, Monica's perverted. Look at that outfit. Get <laughs> going. I know I put her in it, but still. The cutscenes are are just glorious when you do this with the special cutscenes. That's retarded. Why don't they fight Griffin with the robot? Big mech war. He's not even close to that huge. You could kill him in one hit. He's just a stupid bunny boy. Everything about this plan is dumb and I don't like it. Who's not on board? Just shut it down. Shut it down. Shut it down, man. What are you, crazy? Shut it down. Some sick and twisted stuff you got going on there. You touched them in the giblets. I'll wait here. Oh, it's grassy sure now. Get him. We will. Oh, well, I intend to get him, all right. I intend to hit him with guns so hard he has no choice but to die. I like how there's a save point out here. I did never notice that save point before. I guess it's if you wanted to save without going into cutscene town. Because this is cutscene town. Like, if you had to cut it off and leave because your mom was calling you or something. You know, this is a game about moms. Speaking of moms, Chapter I can teach seven. you how to do the duck walk. Palace of Flowers. Ah, yes. The police of Fleurs. Here we are, guys. It's officially end game. Huh? We've done it. We've reached the end of the road. It only took forever and a half and a million years. Hi, spooky ghost lady. Welcome to the Moonflower Palace. I'm what? seeing two moons right there. You have come to fight with Cyrus inside the Moonflower Palace. It looks like she has like butterfly wings. Cyrus? That's like the palace Please, in the background, though. Please don't blame Cyrus. I really hope you are able to see the child's true form. Who are you? I am the ruler of the palace, Alexandra. Cyrus yes. has not yet realized Alexandra. what his role in life is. And neither uh, I, I mean, I'm pretty sure that the crowd watching this doesn't realize it either. I'm gonna admit that. Also, thank you for saying the name Cyrus like a million times, so all this... The, the fake world backdrop that you just put into the game and froze the game about if with this garden could change back to the way it used to be the child may remember everything again please sure open up your hearts and see for yourselves the truth hidden the reality of the situation is you need the name cyrus first room. Please. right right Go and win to get to the fight griffin because cyrus is the key but uh, you, if you don't 100% the garden, it's not going to end well. Let's just say you don't get a good ending. You'll you'll beat the day, but you won't win the girl. You want to win the girl. 
I mean, look at how she's stressed. You want to win the girl. Unless that's your ancestor. Then, no. I mean, your descendant. Which, you know, Monica might be. I'm not sure. Things get really weird with time travel. I mean, he was a... He's the boy with two things and uh, two, two, two chronomals in his blood. How many chromoloms does he have in a, in a light bulb, you know? He's not showing up this time. Ah, yeah, no boss fight right in the foyer. Great. Oops, cut the line out. Didn't mean to. Oh, no. Photos that answer the, prob pu the problem puzzles to the Giorama. We're in a palace. That's what he says. I'm waiting for it. We're in a palace. The woman just now, uh, um, Alexandra. I, I'm yeah. great that you couldn't remember her name. She said there was a clue in the first room, right? Yeah. Well, the first room is this hall. Look, Monica. This looks like look. the palace garden. Luigi, look. Bed like that out there. The oh, yeah. So maybe what convenient was for us to return the palace garden back to what it used to be like like in these pictures I'm uh, sure that's the way I don't like how that angle looked either Griffin in this palace okay I bet you're right it couldn't hurt to try uncovering Griffin's secrets huh oh no sounds good let's do it oh no right. that turns her on more than anything just look at the way she moved Let's do it all right, I guess. Stop. Stop being incestuous with each other, please. I'm not even sure if that's real. It could be. You're, you're not telling me. Game doesn't tell me anything. Game just says, hey, go in the dungeon. Grind weapon. Go in the dungeon. Get a random floor. Get a random floor again. Get a random floor with two coins on it. Get a random floor with nothing but mimics on it. Don't have anything nice handed to you. Just have death handed to you. You know, by 62 hours in, you would have figured we would have got this stuff. Ancient Wind. Ancient Wind. Well, let's let's start this uh, gauntlet. Dark Legacies gauntlet. Because it's going to be a hard-fought endeavor for us. Flowers of the Ruined Palace. Floor episode. Ancient Wind. I am surprised that wasn't a mimic. Oh, that is actually really lucky. Because now I can see how much pain is ahead of me. Now, we're powerful. Don't get me wrong. We're powerful. I admit it. We actually are pretty strong for this. Uh, armlet's a little weak. Gun could be better, honestly. But, uh, sword? Hammer? In really good places right now. For the early floors, at least. And... The enemy counts on these floors are gonna be huge. You've seen all the red dots. Yeah, I'm not gonna chance it. Wait, do I have any more treasure chest keys left? I have one. Might as well blow it. Oh no, it was another Bassard. It wasn't what I wanted. I needed a coin. I need an Absop coin. Oh wow, I can't flinch the silver gears right away. That's gonna be a problem. So, Silver Gears are not fun to fight. If they hit you, they can inflict poison. I believe that is the status they inflict. It could be worse. These guys inflict thirst. Which, they spray out poison-looking vomit. Which, it should just poison you. Oh, look, Geostones. Well, to repair the garden, we're gonna need to collect all the garden parts. So, let's, let's start doing that, too. Might as well. Yeah, but Cyrus, Cyrus's role, it's a little bit silly. You can say that he's a bit of a clown. Kind of like this clown balloon I'm killing with the wrong weapon. I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use gun. I'm gonna use gun. Answer is gun. Let's go kill him with gun. But yeah, I don't think I can take Cyrus seriously at the end of this game, and, you know, it's almost like a clown should fight a clown. Like, we're not even, wor we're not even worthy to kill him. The, the five enemies in this room are more powerful than the guy at the end of the game. And that's only for now anyways, because I'm just going to keep getting stronger and kill everyone. And that right mouse. And that right mouse. 
castle leaders have forks for weapons because they are literally eating this castle full of holes. All right, I mean, you come up with something more clever. I, I'm not the one who invented the enemies here. All the enemies in Griffin's Palace are kind of one-time deals anyways. You can't come back here once you clear the game. You will never see these enemies again if you do not kill at least one of them and put that in information into your book. Unless there's something different in the PAL or Japanese version where it allows you to come back to Griffin's Castle. I know for a fact the USA version doesn't let you come back to the Hall of Flowers here. Or at least I think it does? Shoot, now I'm second guessing myself. It's been a while. The, oh, also the music here? I'm not a, not a big huge fan of it. It's, uh, not so great. Even the battle music sounds different. We're gonna be hearing this a lot. Alright, come on. Oh, come on. No, you don't both get to shoot me. I shoot back. You shoot forward. They're both shooting me. Oh, wow. That was close. Close in one hit. Alright. All right, I see that you poison. I'm not here to play anymore. Uh, I'm just gonna beat the shit out of you from mine. Oh no, I can't flinch them on the first hit. I need more damage. I said we were in a good place, but I actually don't have enough damage to deal with these guys. You always wanna be at a point in the game where your weapons flinch the enemy when you hit them. So you need to build them up to be strong enough to do that. Some of it has to do with the damage number. As you can see, this guy doesn't have a lot of... I don't do not a lot of damage numbers to him, but I can still stun him. Some of it actually has to do with the weakness that you have. Like, Beast Slayer, Elemental Ones, all the defending. Exorcism, in this guy's case. I just think he might be immune to Hammer. Then again, Monica's sword didn't knock back him either. We just need stronger weapons. And as you can see, this floor, this singular floor, has taken us so long that we are almost 18 minutes into the video. We're 7 and uh, 3 fourths. 17 and 3 fourths. I know I didn't start it very early, but I feel like I've been on this floor forever and there's still enemies. So every time I go for these all wipeouts, yeah, it's going to take up a lot of the video. I'm going to, I'm only doing it right now because I'm not strong enough. The EXP here is unfathomably delicious. And it only gets better in the post game. There's a floor called Anxiety in the post game. That is the episode name. This floor has 500 abs per monster nearly. And it's all card men. It is the freest levels you could put into anything. And I intend to like evolve my monster forms there. Because I'm fairly sure you can actually go to the other dungeons. Not, like, not locked out from just Griffin's Palace. You can go to the other dungeons to get the medals you don't have. And I'm going to need to get those medals. I'm going to need to get a lot of medals. I'm going to try to get as many medals in here as possible before it goes away. So, I'm going to be playing a lot of Speeda. I'm going to be doing a lot of things. I'm probably not going to do Speeda if it's not a free game. I won't lie. Oh man, I am almost out of time with this. Alright, that takes care of you guys. Sure did take care of them, at the speed of slow. Oh hey, I got a wipeout medal. Speaking of medals, uh, no. Let's check it out. There's the red ball, and there's the, mm. Well, that's a really hard dar uh, dark leg, dog leg to get through, so I'm, I'm probably not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. You know what? We'll come back. Now, the Moonflower Palace can spawn really weird speed of setups, so... Depending on if it spawns one of these weird ones, we might do it. We might end up playing some speed in these videos. It all depends. So this has been Cool Impact with Let's Play Dark Cloud 2. Next time, speaking of card warriors, we're gonna go take down some playing cards, teach them a lesson.